The personal computer, or PC, is a ubiquitous device that has become a central part of modern life. But the journey to the development of the PC was a long and complex one, with numerous key milestones and contributors along the way. The earliest precursor to the personal computer was the Colossus, an electronic device developed by British codebreakers during World War II to crack German codes. It was a massive machine, weighing several tons, and consisting of thousands of vacuum tubes. Although it was not a general-purpose computer, the Colossus laid the groundwork for the development of the digital computer. The first electronic digital computer, known as the ENIAC, was developed in the United States in the early 1940s. Like the Colossus, it used vacuum tubes and was huge, taking up an entire room. The ENIAC was used to perform complex calculations for the US military, and its development paved the way for further advances in computer technology. Over the next few decades, a number of important developments took place in the field of computing. The invention of the transistor in the 1950s made computers smaller and more reliable, while the introduction of integrated circuits in the 1960s made it possible to pack even more computing power into a smaller space. The first personal computer, the Altair 8800, was introduced in 1975. The Altair was a kit that users could assemble themselves, and it was designed for hobbyists and enthusiasts rather than businesses or individuals. The Altair was a significant breakthrough, however, because it showed that it was possible to create a relatively inexpensive computer that could be used at home. The development of the microprocessor, a single-chip processor that could perform all the functions of a central processing unit, was a key factor in the growth of the personal computer industry. The first microprocessor, the Intel 4004, was introduced in 1971, and by the mid-1970s, microprocessors were being used in a variety of devices, such as calculators and video games. In 1977, two important computers were introduced, the Apple II and the Commodore PET. The Apple II was designed by Steve Wozniak and Steve Jobs, and it was the first successful PC aimed at a mainstream audience. The Commodore PET, developed by Commodore International, was also popular and helped to establish the company as a major player in the personal computer market. The 1980s saw the introduction of a number of important computers, including the IBM PC, which was released in 1981. The IBM PC was a significant breakthrough because it was the first personal computer to be based on an open architecture, meaning that it could be easily modified and expanded by third-party vendors. This made it easier for businesses and individuals to use the PC for a wide variety of tasks. In 1984, Apple introduced the Macintosh, which was the first personal computer to feature a graphical user interface. The Macintosh was a major advance in computer technology, and it helped to make Apple a force in the industry. Microsoft had launched its Windows operating system in the 1980s, but it was in the 1990s that it really took off. Windows 3.0, introduced in 1990, enhanced the usability of the graphical user interface, and Windows 95, sold over 120 million units and grabbed Microsoft 90% of the operating system market. The explosion of the Internet in the 1990s changed the way we use personal computers forever. Suddenly, people could connect with one another from around the world, share information and ideas, and conduct business in new and unprecedented ways. The advent of e-commerce also made it possible for people to shop and conduct financial transactions online, 
further cementing the role of the personal computer in everyday life. The development of faster processors, larger memory capacities, and more powerful graphics cards made it possible for personal computers to handle increasingly complex tasks, such as video editing and gaming. The 2000s saw the rise of mobile computing with the introduction of laptops and smartphones. These devices allowed users to access the internet and perform a wide range of tasks on the go, and they quickly became an essential part of modern life. Laptops became increasingly powerful and affordable, and by the end of the decade, they had become the primary computing device for many people. The introduction of tablets in the early 2010s further revolutionized the personal computer industry. Tablets offered a new form factor and user interface, and they quickly became popular for tasks such as web browsing, email, and media consumption. The rise of the app ecosystem also made it possible to run a wide range of software on tablets, making them more versatile than ever before. In recent years, the focus of the personal computing industry has shifted towards artificial intelligence and machine learning. The development of powerful graphics processing units or GPUs and specialized processors has made it possible to build and run complex AI models on personal computers. Cloud computing has also had a significant impact on the personal computing industry. Cloud services have made it possible to store and access files from anywhere, while web-based applications have made it possible to run complex software without the need for a powerful local machine. From bulky and slow machines that took up entire rooms to sleek, small, powerful devices, the PC has undergone an extensive transformation during its history. From business professionals to gamers to creative professionals, the PC will continue to play a central role in our lives, helping us to work more efficiently, communicate more effectively, and enjoy entertainment in new and exciting ways.